Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. Today in this video I'm going to show you how to convert the Ishing Pro 58RX FetchArg diversity module into a DVR module that will enable you to record your videos and also play it back on a screen. So what you're gonna need for this video is the Ishing Pro 58RX. It costs about $23. The Ishing Pro DVR costs about $13. This adapter costs about a dollar and you're gonna need a LiPo battery. The total cost is going to be about $40. So what I've done, I've used this converter in order to make sure that the output voltage is gonna be five volts. In order to do it, you will need first to solder a JST connector to the N minus and N plus. You can also use an XT60 connector if you'd like. Then test the voltage by using a voltmeter and you will have to rotate this dial until you will reach five volts. Then I soldered two wires from the out minus and the out plus into this port of the Ishing Pro DVR. This one here is the plus and this is the minus. I know it's a bit confusing, but I used these colors. Over here, this is the video out of the Ishing Pro DVR. And also used this connector. You can also use a servo connector if you want. And I soldered the plus to this out plus and the minus to this out minus. The bottom pin is the plus 5 volt, then the third pin from the bottom is the ground, and then all the way up is our video out. So the, here is the video in, and this is the video out. You can also use these ports over here, I'm going to put a link in the description to the manual, and then you can use it for video out, and then it can display your video on an external screen. Then what we need to do, just connect a LiPo battery, you can see that the now the module is turned on. So pressing this button over here makes the video recording start. And then pressing it once again, you can see now the LED indicator is on and now the video recording has finished. Let me quickly connect a quadcopter. So it's recommended to use one directional antenna and one circular antenna. And now we can search for the best signal. And Let's press record. And now the video is recorded. So it's quite easy and it provides a very simple solution for recording on the go. It's probably one of the cheapest way for you to make your DVR recorder and diversity receiver. As I mentioned, you can use the video out and then you can use the video in of any goggles or any screen. As a final touch, I added this heat ring on top and I do recommend you to use a buzzer whenever you're using this device because you want to make sure that the voltage of the battery is not going too low because you don't want to ruin the battery. So thank you for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it and you find it useful. If you did, please subscribe to my channel and don't forget to share it with your friends and see you on my next videos. Goodbye.